So today we're going to be doing police chases with this new chaos mod. And folks, we're going to have everything from force fields, cars falling from the sky, asteroids, and all sorts of insane effects. And our objective is pretty simple. We're going to start out on the main island here in West Coast USA, and we must make it all the way over to the lighthouse. So do you guys think we're going to be able to survive? Stay tuned to find out. Oh my goodness, I don't know what we're in store for here today, but I know it's going to be totally chaotic. Now, one thing to note, this chaos mod isn't like one of those ones that's on like a timer I hope eventually we get an update where it does that but for our first chase like I said I need to make it over to the island uh, we're gonna go ahead and enable a couple of these so I'm gonna accelerate nearby traffic so uh, you could select the radius so how close you are to it and how fast they'll go I mean why not have them go up to 670 miles an hour uh, and we're going to start off with this, and then I've got other ones like explode nearby vehicles. There's one that drops items, or uh, I guess stuff from the sky. <laughs> so, you know what, let's just start off small here. <laughs> this is going to be awesome. I've always wanted a mod like this in Beam and G. I know we had one similar that we raced with, uh, that, oh, I think it was old Rossi had made. Uh, that was pretty good, but this one, the whole fact that it affects all the traffic is going to be amazing. Okay, I'm getting near this police... Oh my goodness. Okay, there's a chance I might want to slow it down because it just pops the vehicles. <gasps> oh, we're going to get a lot of instabilities on this episode today, folks. And, oh, <laughs> you know, oh, all right, we made it off the first mountain. You know, maybe we should turn that down. I feel like I'm going to make this chase impossible. Okay, I'm going to up the radius to be really big. That way I have a bigger chance of getting hit by one of the cars, but I'm going to turn them down to like, let's say 200. I feel like two. <laughs> I just watched one fly off 200 that might be kind of good right I mean that's still pretty deadly uh, as you can see all right so let's just try to get off the mountain if I can get down to the streets the only thing I'm a little fearful of I'm probably gonna have to hit the highway and the highway is gonna be total chaos here so yeah <laughs> just stay tuned folks it's only gonna get even more chaotic when I enable like all of them well actually there might be a couple I won't like the force field we've seen what the force field does I think this one's adjustable uh, but that kind of benefits the player, uh, if you ask me. You know another funny thing? I think we're going to get down here. And okay. Yep, that could definitely be deadly. I think it's whatever like direction the AI is aimed in is where they go. So if they're aimed my way, 200 miles an hour, we're not dodging that. We're not dodging that. Oh, my goodness. Okay. Yep, this is total chaos. I love this. I love that this has been added into Beam and G Drive. It's just it's another like fun thing that we get to do. All right. Uh, let's go ahead. Let's try to get to the highway. Is there an on-ramp over here? No, I don't think there is. Hold on. We're going to have to go through town. Oh, my goodness. Okay. Uh, dodge those. Dodge those. No, no. That one's going to be aimed towards us. Oh! Oh, he clipped us! Are we good, though? I think it just... Wow, it just popped the tire. Like, you're going to see damage that looks weird here because it was like a 200-mile-an-hour missile just clipped us there. Not an explosive missile, which we can make them explosive if we want to. Oh, this was a mistake. Going in a freaking tunnel? No, 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 no. Okay, just keep dodging, keep dodging. Just stay to the inside of the tunnel. I think they'll aim to the outside. I got to cross here. Can I cross? Get a oh, Wait, that one took off. Oh, whoa. Okay, we just almost got clipped by one on the ramp. Okay, look behind us. Oh, my goodness. This is fun. Uh, we're definitely going to have to do more of this. Also, I heard this works in multiplayer. Um, I don't know how we would approach doing this in multiplayer, but I want to do it in multiplayer really bad. I feel like it's going to create all sorts of chaotic effects, and it's going to be amazing. Oh, my. Yeah, jumping on the highway was definitely a mistake. It looks like it's a one-time launch, though. I did notice. Oh, my goodness. That was over a tire. Uh, so when they launch off, they'll launch, and then as soon as they stop, they don't seem like they launch again because i've actually passed by some like no never mind they they are i'm actually pushing them down the highway it's like a little delay though oh my goodness oh okay uh all right let's take the exit here let's get off the highway the highway was pretty deadly oh this is just one of the effects yeah we're gonna have to turn almost all of them on at the end uh like i said there's gonna be a couple that i won't like the force field i think would benefit the player uh we've played with the force field before uh, i think maybe turning it up really high would be kind of funny but uh-oh, 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 okay. They're going there. There's just pieces flying. I almost wonder what the drop mod is. I think it drops cars from the sky. I don't know if it drops them, like, directly at the player, so you have to keep moving. Also, there's a speed mod, and funny enough, there's another speed mod that was just added to the repo that we're going to be checking out here soon, too. 
uh, recreating the movie speed. All right. Oh, this is going to be tough. We got to take the bridge now. All right, someone take a right. Uh, how do you want... I think you want to stay in the right lanes. Because if they're aimed towards you, they're going to come flying at you. But if they're aimed away, obviously they're going to fly away. The only problem is we're going to get to a tunnel here in a second that's probably going to be fairly deadly. Hey, I've only been pelted by one car, though. Uh, we got that going for us. You know, dude, we're going to have to revisit this, too. Like, what if I were to turn traffic up to, like, 30, maybe... If I, my system can handle it, 40 cars, there will be cars flying everywhere. Uh-oh. Okay. I should not have gone this way. I'm in the oncoming. If there's a car around the corner. <laughs> not going to lie, I slightly jumped. I like how the police are pursuing me, but are they really? <laughs> I don't think they're pursuing me. No. No. Oh, my goodness. That one just flew over us. Hold on. Does the car still run? How does this thing still run? This thing is tough as nails. Uh, I need to try to get to the lighthouse. I mean, technically... I've made it to the island. I mean, this is already a win. I didn't think I'd make it this far. Oh, that car's aimed at us. Okay, minivan almost just... Oh, oh my goodness. Okay, they're all just... I am in the wrong lane. Um, okay, come on. The lighthouse is right up here. I'm overheating. Look at how much damage we have. I have no clue how this SUV is still driving. Uh, piston rings are damaged. It's going to explode here in a second. But doesn't matter. Made it to the lighthouse. Uh, just in time. My goodness. Uh, yep. That's awesome. Uh, <laughs> we get hit by two cars at 200 miles an hour. Okay, are we ready for the next effect here? So, should we keep the accelerated traffic? Um, I kind of want to. There's also an explode nearby vehicles, which would make them into, like, exploding missiles. Uh, also, drop objects. I don't know how this works. Oh, you could select the object type. So you can go with rocks, props, vehicles, simple vehicles. So I guess, you know what? I want it to rain down vehicles. This might not be a good idea. Also, I can accelerate it. Let's go maybe every two seconds a vehicle falls. Um, wait, object count 50. Do we really want 50 vehicles? Let's, let's try 10 real quick. All right, let's test the effect out real quick just to see what happens. Oh, it is freezing. Okay, maybe 10 vehicle. Maybe we should have did rocks. Maybe we should start with rocks. I feel like we just broke something because my game keeps pausing itself. All right, let's swap this over to rocks real quick. Uh, maybe we'll turn the vehicles down to like five. I guess if you didn't have traffic on, this would be a little bit easier. Let's try this one real quick. All right, so I'm going to fly. Give it a second. I see a rock. Oh my goodness. This is officially created like asteroids. Wait, what are they doing though? They're like bouncing. Dude, they are fast. Okay, I need to turn this up. This is going to be a problem because it's every two seconds. I'm going to have it drop 100 rocks. Okay, so let me go. Wow, game. Thanks. I don't think there's no way I could survive this. All right, I'm going to start moving and then I'm going to apply it. Okay, and uh-oh. Uh-oh, I've definitely made a mistake. All right, there is a such thing as too good of a, you know, a good thing here. Uh, let's turn it down. Let's maybe go 50 rocks. Uh, let's try that. Or, you know what, maybe 38. Can we do 38? Let's apply and close. And let's start. Oh, my goodness. Look at the shadows. Holy, ma dude, it's like asteroids. Like, we are, I mean, I don't even call it a police chase. We're just trying to race to the other island before getting pelted by a gigantic rock. Look at it. They're all over the city. This is one of the most incredible sights I think I've ever seen in BMG Drive. Like, I, oh man, I'm, I'm in love with this mod. You're, you guys are going to see this more. This We're going to definitely do more of this. Uh, I need different combinations. Oh, <gasps> okay. So that's an instant death there. By the way, I hear, oh, I still have the accelerated vehicles on too. So there is traffic still in the city. They're just flying around and potentially getting pelted by asteroids. I kind of wish there was a little flaming effect for each one of these. <laughs> I feel like that would be absolutely awesome. All right, so it's officially a police chase during an asteroid event. Um, this is great. Uh, yep, okay. It's lagging a little bit. It's actually not bad. I'm actually surprised by how well this is handling it. I mean, if this was 38 cars, we'd be getting the instability. I think you could only probably maybe do it if you turn off the traffic and maybe do five. I don't wonder if maybe the cars are accelerating still. We'll have to try it again. We'll do raining cars here in a minute. And I'll turn off the acceleration because maybe that's what's breaking it. Yeah, because those cars are disappearing. Like, look at the cars in front of us. As soon as they take off, they go, like, back to the future. and Like, they're, they're just gone. Oh, wait, hold on. Never mind. We got a group here. Uh, oh. Okay. Come on. 
Come on. Okay, let's go to the right. If I can get some speed on the highway. Oh, dude, they're landing all... I, I'm not gonna lie. I have my game volume way too loud. I jump every time that happens. It's just pure death. Absolute pure death. Okay, I think we're gonna need a faster vehicle because outrunning these rocks, it's been chaotic. Let's get a scintilla out. I just got destroyed again. Like I could hear it happening in the background. Oh, I just, I was flying to the sky. All right, I'm gonna place myself off of the mountain here because I feel like this is gonna be hard enough to do. Like. Uh, even with the scintilla like getting off that thing because you're so slow. Let's try speeding through the asteroids here Oh, dude, they get they'll like get stuck. Oh, you can see them spawning a little bit better now Especially now that we're going fast like you can see how the spawning actually works. All right, we got accelerated vehicles in front of us. Oh my goodness Okay, uh, oh no nope. police are pursuing me. I mean sure uh, You can call it that whatever <laughs> this is, I can't get over how awesome it's like the coolest thing ever. I do wish, like I said, we can get a, it to like randomize like every so many seconds, say like every minute or maybe 30 seconds. Uh, but the mod author has done a tremendous job just creating something so cool in the game. Okay, uh, keep going, keep going. Uh, police are after us. Oh, they just accelerated and died. Uh, it's fine. As long as they're not aimed this way, we're good. My goodness, I saw that rock coming. Uh, editor, can we get a slow-mo replay? The, the spawn on that was on point. It just shot right down to us. I feel like this is it's way too much. Way too much. Uh, asteroids, I mean, if I turned them down, probably would be okay. <laughs> but let's try the cars again. So I'm going to turn off Accelerate Trap. Let me turn everything off. Let, let the game breathe for a second. Let's drop cars. So I'm going to turn on the drop objects. We're going to turn it back to cars. Um, let me turn it down. Can I do like 10? Uh, these are a much more advanced physics object, obviously, so I don't know if the game can handle this. Uh, maybe I need to turn traffic off, too. Hold on. Oh, nope. It's definitely still pausing. Uh, even though I, I thought maybe it was the vehicle acceleration was also causing it fits. Uh, let me turn it down. Let me see if I can get five uh, going here. Okay, I've turned it down to four. Okay, four seems to work. All right, so, yep, there are cars... I mean, it still looks like way more than four. Oh my goodness. Okay. So depending on how fast you're going, you might have to adjust this because the scintilla is so fast that the cars don't have a chance to fully fall down. Uh, well, some of them are. I mean, this is still pretty... Okay, this is terrifying. It is now raining cars from the sky. Okay. Uh, objective still the same. Actually kind of fun dodging these, trying to anticipate. Plus, some of them disappear and some don't. Some actually hit the ground, so you don't know which one's going to actually come down and attempt to murder you. Oh, okay. That is... Oh, wait. Oh, yeah. You know, I forgot. The traffic aren't affected anymore. So I'm actually legit getting chased. I mean, good luck keeping up with me because I'm in a, a very, very high-powered uh, supercar. But, oh, my goodness. Dude, okay. The traffic's making this worse. Trying to deal with, like, navigating through them and then trying not to get hit in the face with the car. Uh, this is the thing. Hold on. Maybe it'll take out the cop in front of us. Uh, that would be incredible. Oh, dude, there's freaking three officers. Okay. Well, I mean, I was saying they go. Oh, man, that shadow looked like it was going to hit us. Oh! Oh, that was a nice hit there. Move. You're going too slow. You're going to get us killed by falling cars. Oh, okay. That one fell down. That one definitely broke my tire. That one's... Okay, hold on. Accelerate. This thing's going to be crab walking. Oh, dude, that one... Oh, I think it clipped the cop there. Uh, if it didn't, it came very close. <laughs> Oh, no. Okay. Go this way. No. No. Okay. We had to bounce off that one. All right. Come on. Come on. Dude, that right rear tire aimed out is the worst thing ever. Like, that is the worst feeling in Beam and G Drive is when you get clipped like that. And, yeah, you're just like, oh, completely sideways. No, oh, my goodness. Okay. No, this is great. Uh, just sideways as can be. I, I do think it looks like some of the cops are actually disappearing. That's weird. Uh. Oh my goodness. Does this count? I mean, technically, we're on the other island. I know I was kind of setting it up to where it's like, oh, I need to make it to the lighthouse, but I didn't realize how truly chaotic this would be. Like, I did not test this ahead of time. I wanted to go into this, like, just fresh uh, and just check it out. And you know what? We're going to give myself half a point there. I, I want to keep testing out different combinations, though. Okay, so if I can maybe get away one more time, maybe I can turn on... You know, I've already gotten away. I think I can turn on the force field. I do want to try the explode 
nearby vehicles. I probably shouldn't turn this on right now. Wait, is the explosion actually enough to affect the, the player car? So if I explode them, this is morally just going to be a visual thing. It's going to look incredible going down the highway watching everybody combust. I guess it does still technically, like, it's going to create an obstacle. Yeah, they're blowing up. It's weird, though, because you can't see the fire effect. But if you look, they're actually fully falling apart. Uh, that's, that's cool. Hold on, if I slow down, though... Yeah, everything accelerated actually, like, almost like delays or gets rid of the effect. But, like, when you're driving through a little bit slow, it just, that looks incredible. Like, all the cars flaming up on slow down even more. Uh, there we go. Oh, yeah, I guess it just doesn't happen sometimes. I mean, you're definitely, like, you're losing all the parts. Dude, we got to do the chaos mod on the Crash Hard Mountain. We got to have, like, just stuff happening to us. Uh, okay. I, I like this one. I mean... This one, I guess, combined with some of the other ones would make it, like, awesome. Uh, oh, on. Oh, look at all the bright explosions, man. The bloom effect is absolutely lovely. Uh, also, the amount of smoke that they let off on. There's, like, debris rolling down towards us. Okay, that one's pretty cool. Not necessarily very useful for us in this style of chase. Uh, all right, so I'm going to turn that one off. Speed mode. Dude, they just pulled up on me and exploded immediately. That's actually kind of cool. Speed mode, I'm going to save that because there also is another speed mod. I might have to compare it to the two. Uh, I want to save that for another video. So what I think we're going to do, let's try a combination of things here. I, I want to try the force field. So the multiplayer, wait, times one. I wonder if that's the default force field. So what's times 10? Oh my goodness. Everything just took off. I mean, we've seen the force field before. It's like a, uh, it was kind of like a thing. I don't even know if it was announced when it was added. It was like a sneaky thing. It was like, hey, did you know there's a force field and beam? I believe this effect just amplified it. It was set to one, which I'm assuming would be the default one. Now it's times 10. So when we get close, can I speed through here at full speed? Oh my goodness. Dude, it's so good. Oh, okay. Oh, wait. I can fully stay like wide open here. I don't think there's a chance I get hit. I mean, the force field is going to push them away. That times 10 is so awesome. Yeah, I could just speed through here. Oh, the tunnel's going to look insane. I, this has kind of turned to, like, not doing police chases. I mean, to be fair, we got some of them, man. Uh, there's just some effects where it's like, the police don't have a chance here. It, it's like, <laughs> I've got superhuman strength here. I'm, like, force pushing these cars through this tunnel. It's creating, like, a tsunami of car, though. Like, it's a big wave. Oh, I managed to still hit the wall. All right, I'm going to reset it here. <laughs> I, You know, I kind of... I think I need to pause it real quick. What does this look like on the other side of the tunnel? Like, this stuff shooting out. Hold on. Uh, go over here. And... Oh, wow. Okay. That is rather impressive. You know, I was looking for maps that I could do, like, a big highway run on. I think we're going to go over to the Autobahn. I'm going to turn on as much traffic as possible. And I think if we could survive a run down the Autobahn... Like, I mean, that would be golden, because I, I think that'd be the perfect place to test out a lot of these, uh, since you're going to be so wide open there. Okay, I'm going to attempt to spawn in 30 vehicles here. Uh, normally, I can get away with that, depending on the map. The Autobahn map, obviously wide open, just not a lot. I mean, there's a lot of, like, shrubbery. Uh, I hear a lot of scraping. Is my Chaos mod still on? Why am I hearing this? Uh, they're still... Sp oh, they all spawned in. Oh, it's still on! I just totally force pushed those people. Okay, I'm going to turn this on. All right, let's get the force off real quick. Let them get moving. Uh, all right, let me turn off this UI, and then we're going to test some of the effects. I want to do the accelerating vehicles with this one. By the way, which way is the right way? You guys are turning around this way, but in... Wait, are we on Germany? Are we, are we on the right side of the road, home? Where is the AI going? Okay, no, they're going along. Okay, so what I'm going to do... Actually, the sunburst is aimed right at me, and it's going to immediately kill me if I turn this on. Uh, let's do this again. So we are going to accelerate. Oh, yeah, I forgot. We haven't played with the player one. Um, that That's just death. Like, I can make this truck go 112. We'll, we'll, we'll hold on that one real quick. Uh, I want to accelerate the nearby traffic. Let's go a little bit more extreme. Let's go closer to 300 miles an hour. I like the radius being really big. Also, I just now noticed that there's the exclude broken vehicles. I think that's what I was seeing earlier. So I'm going to have it on... Even for broken vehicles. Oh, this is going to be painful. All right, here we go. Three, two, one, apply. 
Oh my goodness. All right, so do you think we can make it down the whole Autobahn here? Gee, we're not going to make it. I, we're not going to make it a mile down this thing. Oh, dude, that with the broken vehicles has made this so much worse. Oh, I just ran over debris. Did that pop my tire? Okay, a lot of the traffic spawning on this side. We might actually be good. if they No, they still spawn in on the other side, too. Watch how fast they're going <laughs> to... Dude, that's the speed of, like, a top fuel dragster. <laughs> Except for it's just all traffic. Oh, my goodness. Dude, there is just, like, this infinite crash happening in front of us. Okay, let's dodge bumpers because those will blow out tires. Uh, I mean, this kind of feels like a force field. Oh, my goodness. Okay, keep it moving. Nope, nope, nope. Okay, turn it around. Turn it around. I don't think I blew out tires there. Oddly enough, like I felt, did something break? Well, the exhaust is hanging down, or the muffler is. Uh, bumper's been popped off, missing a headlight. Okay, we're still good. All right, we're coming up to another group of cars. This is incredible. You know, it, maybe I should run down with like a Bugatti or maybe one of the fastest like Scintillas. I feel like, oh, okay. That happened really fast. That car just, I don't know how it was aimed towards us when we were in the right side, but <laughs> that thing just split the body off the chassis so quick. <laughs> oh my, uh, this is wonderful. All right, I'm going to keep going here. I hear stuff crashing around me and it's terrifying. I'm trying to spawn in this Bugatti. So do we think we could accelerate down the Autobahn with this? Like, I mean, obviously, like, one of the fastest vehicles. Like, production vehicles, I should say. You know, we can make it faster if I did want to turn up that. Oh, this is... Yeah, there's no way. I think the faster the vehicle, the more chance of death you have. I, I can't even control it anymore. I mean, we could make the Bugatti faster. There is the option to make this thing a 600-mile-an-hour bullet. I feel like the body panels are going to rip off. Cause, and not because of the speed. Like, I'm sure aerodynamics, you could probably handle it. It's going to be that initial acceleration, and oh, we've got an instability. Yep. This is kind of working right now. Oh, another one. Yeah, you're going to get a lot of pauses with this. Uh, we are... Why did that van not accelerate? I drove forward thinking that van was about to take off at like 600 miles an hour, and it did not. It is... Or actually, I think it's 300 right now. Um, Yeah, this isn't a good idea. We could try one more time with the asteroids. And then we're going to accelerate. All right, let's, let's turn off the traffic real quick. That's just, that's insanity there. Hold on, let's go drop objects again. Uh, turn it back to, I mean, you got props. I don't know what the props are. Oh, there's a simple vehicle one. That would probably, I like the, the having the normal vehicles because you get that satisfying crunch. Maybe the simple ones don't damage or maybe they're not as, I guess, complicated. Uh, I want to do the rocks one more time here. Let's do the rocks. Let's do 30 of them. I'm going to apply this. They should be killing traffic, too. Uh-oh. Okay, 30 might be too much. Oh, wait, they're spawning in right now. Hold on. Oh, my goodness, they're falling on us. Okay, so 30 rocks. We are running with traffic, and we're running against an asteroid here. I actually... I think we're fat. Oh, I was going to say, I think we're fast enough to outrun the spawn, but no, they still drop in front of us. And you can expand that radius out. There's, like, so many different ways to customize this mod. That's what makes it just pure, like, it's pure insanity. And the whole fact that this thing, and I was talking to my buddy Ashmaker, this thing is compatible with multiplayer. Like, we could do these effects. I don't know if you could do them quite as extreme, since it's going to be one of those things where it's got to load for everyone. Uh, but, oh man, <laughs> this is just, I, I can't do this. I, I think we just have to turn up the acceleration here on the uh, the player. I mean, if I had the force field, I guess I, sh I could push the rocks away. But yeah, I think we've uh, we've definitely created chaos today. I mean, this is we've accomplished the uh, the goal of the video. Also, there's a crash camera here. I haven't really looked at that. I'm assuming it's like some neat little effect there. Hold on, let's go accelerate player vehicle. I can go up to 670. Okay, so it doesn't accelerate it with the gas. It just literally accelerates it. Like period. What? Oh, what? Okay, I've got crash cam enabled right now because definitely we were getting like a cinematic cam. Maybe, maybe we turn that down a little bit, huh? What, what do you guys say? Yeah, I mean, maybe, maybe 300. Is that, is that good? Is that appropriate? Okay, so the crash camera is actually kind of cool. Oh my, dude. Okay, even just the simple effect of the crash camera, it puts it in slow-mo. I mean, this is not helping us right now, 
Look at the body panels bend. Hold on, can I put this in slow-mo? I'm probably gonna turn the crash camera off. It's a neat little effect though, but it probably works much better when you're not moving this fast. Okay, is this in slow-mo? Real time. This is slow-mo. This is what my vehicle's doing. This is what happens when you activate this kind of speed on a Bugatti. It just, it literally takes off. Like, <laughs> it's like one of those crazy things where you see like the prototype race cars when they're going too fast, so, like air gets under the car and they take off and they fly. Like it's essentially like the same effect. Just a little bit more extreme. I am, you know, I'm actually surviving right now. We're going up the Autobahn and I haven't touched the ground because the player acceleration is just set to what it is. So it lifts, it goes down, lifts, goes down, lifts, goes down. My goodness, this is glorious. Like I said, we're coming back to this. Comment down below what your idea is. I, I think we're going to have to do a crash hard mountain race with chaos. Uh, and we'll see you guys next time here in BMG Drive.